speed review. This is the iPad Air. It's pretty similar to the previous model, but there is one major change. Now it has the M1 chip. Yep, you heard that right. The same thing that's running one of these is now in a mid-ranged iPad. And that means this thing can pretty much handle anything you throw at it. High-end games, multiple apps, 3D drawing, it all runs flawlessly. For tablet stuff, this just works. And I find myself using this pretty much every day now. But as always, iPadOS just doesn't give you the same tools or features a laptop would, meaning a lot of things you would like to do with an M1 powered machine just can't be done, or are at least a lot harder to pull off. There is no doubt that this iPad is the choice for most people looking for the best tablet at a somewhat affordable price, but it's certainly not your next computer.